introducing to you the Summerlin Trail System. And that's what I'm talking about today. So let's roll. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor, and welcome to my Summerlin series. Today, we're gonna to be talking about the Summerlin Trail System. But before we get started, you know what to do, right? Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. Did you know that there are over 200 miles of trails in Summerlin? Whether you're a cyclist, a runner, a parent with a stroller, or just someone who loves to be outdoors, the Summerlin Trail System has you covered. The Summerlin Trail System is actually comprised of four different trails. The first type of trail is the street side trails and the street side trails are the backbone of the Summerlin trail system, always landscaped on both sides and set several feet off the road. Street side trails vary in width from five to eight feet and are designed to serve both serious and casual users, ideal for walking, jogging, and strolling. The next is the village trails and the village trails are often located in natural arroyos or man-made open space corridors within the village and off street areas and are designed to provide respite from noise and traffic and serve long distance walkers, runners, cyclists, skaters, and children traveling to and from school. These trails open up to natural view corridors for all to enjoy. Next is the regional trails and regional trails are planned as part of the proposed 2000 plus mile valley wide trail system that will eventually connect the Summerlin trail system with trails throughout the Las Vegas Valley and Red Rock Canyon National Conservation Area. Proposed trails are located along the 8 mile 215 beltway and along the flood control channels in Summerlin and are designed for multiple non-motorized use. Regional trails are being constructed as a public-private partnership of Clark County and the City of Las Vegas in cooperation with the Howard Hughes Corp. Next is natural trails, and the natural trails will be located along Summerlin's western border. These trails will connect the Summerlin trail system with regional trails located near the Red Rock Canyon National Conservation Area. Natural trails will be located in low-density areas and are intended for use by outdoor enthusiasts and hiking buffs. The first 5.5 mile phase of the Clark County Red Rock Canyon Legacy Trail project will begin in Summerlin near Sky Vista Drive, linking directly to the Red Rock Visitor Center. That's actually pretty cool. I mean, I knew it was gonna happen. I don't know when all of this is gonna take place or when they're gonna be completed, but it's actually pretty cool that this will Summerlin will be connected to Red Rock Canyon. I like that idea. And that we have over 200 miles of trails in the Summerlin Village. I like the fact also that kids can go from school uh, just using the trail system, which is pretty cool. And, and that's one of the reasons why they did the village trails. So kids can go from the trails to the school in a safe manner. Let me know if you take adventure on any of the trail systems in Summerlin or what your comments or concerns about them or you know what your thoughts are on the Summerlin trail system. As always, make sure you, you know, hit that like button, share, and subscribe, of course, because I like to talk a lot about Summerlin. Thank you so much for watching, and I can't wait to see you guys on the next one.